like to thank you for choosing to fly with us today. I wish it was a stay here in St. Thomas. Want to stay here, remain seated, enjoy part of the aircraft. Thank you. Hello, beautiful people. So, um, as you guys saw, I've landed. I'm back home in St. Thomas. Feels really good to be home. Um, right now, I am at. Right now, I'm at my dad's job because um, I'm waiting for him to take me home. He wanted me to drive, but it's been two years. I have not driven on the left side of the road in two years and i don't feel comfortable also my license is, my license is expired which he does not care about um but i'm not trying to get arrested <laughs> so i told him that i would just wait for him here um excuse the lighting let me kind of twist yeah i told him i would just wait for him here um and i actually do have a ton of work for grad school to do um yeah just wanted to give you guys a little update I it feels so good to be back home like you don't know that you miss it until you miss it like you don't know that you miss it until like you're gone like when I'm in Hawaii I don't miss it like that I just miss like the food but I'm actually kind of glad to be back actually kind of glad to be back so yeah I'm just gonna finish up this work just wanted to pop in and say hey um, and like I said, we're gonna get something to eat and I'm gonna show you guys what I get. I don't know what I'm gonna get into like tomorrow or the day after. I do have class twice this week. So I just like, I have that to consider, but yeah, just wanted to come in say hey and to kind of like give an intro to the St. Thomas portion of this vlog. baby so this is megan's bay i hope you guys can hear me um this is is this the only beach this is the only beach on saint thomas that you have to pay for as far as i remember it's been a minute <laughs> um but this is my favorite beach to go to like in the mornings because there's not really anyone here when my friend and me used to visit like we would we would come out here and do yoga and then go swimming that was absolutely perfect so um but this is the busiest beach this is the beach that um tourists come to because i um this beach was like listed as top tier so tourists come here whenever um they come to st thomas so um yeah let me show you guys again i don't think i have anything else to say about it but the water is nice and blue when people come to st thomas and like you see pictures or when i see pictures on instagram this is what like they're usually like at this beach like for sure oh i miss this I have my book. This is not what I consider to be a beach read based on like what I've heard about it. But we're definitely going to get into this. Um, the Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo. And we're going to chill for a bit. Maybe even take a nap. Exciting. And then we're going to get in the water. from the yard 
So another thing that I miss about home is that um, you don't buy mangoes. No, we don't buy mangoes. You don't buy mangoes from a grocery store. You best believe you have mango trees growing in your backyard. And they smell so good. Listen, if your mango does not smell sweet, I don't know what's better, smelling the mango before eating it or actually eating it, you know? <sighs> so good. So I'm gonna definitely eat this. It's my beach snack. It's really tiny and cute. The tiny ones are the good ones. Remember I told you, the tiny ones are the good ones, honey. The water is not clear. We can't go in it. I have my mango. Hello, lovely people. So, um, I did everything that I had to do today. I got my license, at least a temporary one. So, awesome, awesome. And, um, what else do I have to do? Yeah, so I actually went to get like my wedding rings or resized. I haven't been wearing them because I gained so much weight, like they can't fit on my hands anymore. So I went to get those resized. I stopped by White House Park Market. That's where I used to work um, for years. And I had to tell like my old coworkers hi. Some of them weren't there, so I do have to go out. So I'll probably take you guys with me that time, the second time around. And I went to this spa in Yacht Haven Grande called Prana Spa. I used to get like my waxes, my Brazilian waxes and stuff from them. Um, so I wanted to book a pedicure for myself, my mom and my dad. Um, my dad has never gotten a pedicure before and he's like traditional old island guy. Like many men aren't supposed to be getting pedicures. So I booked him a pedicure. Fun we i wanted us all to go at the same time but he can't come tomorrow so i booked him an appointment for a saturday so he's gonna go by himself and i spoke to his co-worker she's gonna make sure that he goes because i don't trust him i feel like he's not gonna go um yeah so today was busy i'm finally back home i'm gonna do some work for a little bit i have i'm be i'm behind in school and i mean is gonna kill me if he finds out but i'm really behind so i do have a lot of work to do I'm gonna work and then I'm going to um, go to Agave, which is my favorite, favorite, favorite Mexican restaurant here um, in St. Thomas. It used to be Gringos, but Agave, Agave was always. So I'm gonna see if it's still like really good. Oh, I did wanna show you guys my backyard really quickly. I wanna show you guys my backyard because in the Caribbean, listen, you don't go to the store. You don't go to the grocery store and buy mangoes. So, these mangoes don't look too, too hot. But here we have some mangoes. My mom picked them or they fell down. These are grafted mangoes, just in case you've never seen them before. Um, don't mind my nails. I'm going to do them tomorrow. But the grafted mangoes, they always have a hefty chin, like Stan from um, American Dad big chin and then there's always like a little there's always like a little point on one of the sides so you see this little point that right there there's always that on one of the sides like this one meaty chin and then this side does have like a little peak just a tiny little peak it's really subtle these are really small mangoes and they smell so sweet i think these are kidneys like they're i think they're a little different from the one that i had when when i was at the beach but um this is a different type obviously than this 
this is the one this is the one i had at the beach like it's not really kidney it's just round and fat oh and it smells so good this one smells really sweet so i just wanted to show you guys we pick mangoes from off the floor or like just off the tree not off the floor but like off the tree if it falls sometimes then that's fine but i'm gonna show you some of the trees i'm not climbing up the hill or anything i just miss having like fruit trees and stuff in the backyard so iconic so iconic one of five i think um you can see the mangoes hanging off there some of them like i'm seeing some of them they're like they're almost ready but not really but most of them aren't so look at all those mangoes guys oh. but my dad has so much chickens in the yard that sometimes they drop on the floor and the chickens like peck the living daylights out of them like look ridiculous and then there's one over here of this mango tree it's like on an incline well it's not on an incline but it's like lower down the can you guys see some of the mangoes yeah you can see some of the mangoes these are that more reddish orange mango that i showed you inside that's from this tree so these are more red orange and then the small ones that i like they're more red green like the small fat ones they're not red green i'm so sorry the small fat ones are more yellow green but my parents are replanting their like whatever it is they need um i don't know what everything is i might have to get my mom out here to kind of explain to you guys oh this is tibosh i think they call this time spanish time or something like that even though you know I know for a fact this is rosemary um I think these are tomatoes no I think those are tomatoes there guys I suck at like identifying plants but um and then I think these are spinach leaves so you know in the Caribbean we are so used to having plants in the backyard so she's gonna plant all of these um over here they're gonna dig this out more fun and she's also going to build this is a little storage storage house thing that we have in the backyard she's also gonna build like something so that she can put plants all along there so that's gonna be cute yeah so i really just wanted to show you guys the situation in the backyard i'm gonna be eating so much mangoes while i'm here okay so i'm back inside now as i said i'm going to be um doing some work but i guess i can show you my outfit of the day i'm all over the place today but it's okay um i've been out as you guys know i've been out as you guys know i don't know why this has become so wrinkly but i'm wearing this linen top from zara these shorts from aritzia you know what shoes i already have on these are my these are my island shoes, my summer shoes, my everyday shoes. Um, my ring from Ana Luisa. Yeah. So, rings from Ana Luisa. This is a ring that I always have on. Um, I actually should have taken this ring to size now that I think of it. You don't want to see the dent that I have in my, my thumb. But, yeah. This is, this is the outfit really just i don't know why this looks like this it was not like this all the time oh i was lying down on my mom's bed having a conversation with her so that's why that looks like that but i'm going to get to work now i'm going to stop saying that i'm going to get to work and actually get to work and um i will see you guys at agave i'm sweating it's hot in here
good morning so today i am off to get what's that oh today i'm off to get some pates from this food van that i love that's um on the airport stretch that's what we call it but on the same road as like the airport here um so i'm gonna get some pates i'm gonna get some conch soup if they have fingers crossed i'm kind of late it's seven it's almost 7 30 i was supposed to wake up like an hour ago <laughs> but um i was up late doing work so it is what it is so i'm gonna rush down there and see what they have the only thing is i don't know if they i don't remember if they take um cards like debit or credit cards so just to be safe i'm gonna stop i feel like it's 2022 when they should right but just to be safe, I'm going to I'm gonna have to stop at an ATM to get like some cash out. But yeah, gonna gonna go down the road and get that right now. Um, yeah, I don't know what else to say. <laughs> and then tomorrow, I still have so much food that like I need to get. Tomorrow, um, there's always this lady that's down on what we call Market Street and i hope she's still doing it i think i asked and someone said yeah she's still there um so i'm gonna get some goat water from her and some sauce because i haven't had those in years and yeah that's what i used to go to her for some goat water and some sauce so i'm gonna go get my food but first start to the atm and i'm gonna see you guys um i'm gonna show you guys everything I don't know if I'm gonna take some for Amin or if I'm gonna wait till next week to get then freeze it then go like go about my business and leave because I'm leaving on Tuesday and today is Friday the the time is passing by and then today I also have to go um I booked an appointment at this spa in um Yacht Haven it's where um the white house back market is i'm telling you guys this is if you know but this lady she's supposedly so good and um it's supposedly really hard to get an appointment with her but luckily today she had like three slots available so i was like fate and my dad has never gotten a pedicure before but when i called him to ask him if he could like leave work for like an hour and 15 minutes um he said no <laughs> so um what i did was i booked i booked um a pedicure for him tomorrow um tomorrow morning and his co-worker slash like best friend is gonna make sure that he goes because my father is ridiculous he's all oh real caribbean caribbean man don't get no pedicure what, what i look like i gonna be walking different after i get a pedicure and i'm like sir why are you so dramatic is it really that serious so he's gonna get a pedicure i'm <clears throat> his friend is gonna his best friend is gonna make sure of it so awesome and um yeah after that i i really have some schoolwork to do i i i really don't think i'm gonna be getting into anything today um yeah i think my mom wants to go in the yard and check to see like if any mangoes are ready because if they fall i think i told you guys this but if they fall um my dad's chickens because we have a ton of chickens running around in the yard my dad's chickens will like eat them before like we get to eat them so um we have to go check to see which ones are ready so we can pick them and all of that good stuff and i think that will be it for today i don't know if i'm meeting up with anyone tonight but um i'm late so Let's go get these patties and this kong soup. Listen. Listen, I am upset. They don't have any patties ready, like none. And I drove all the way down here. But they did have kong soup. I don't know if I'll eat this now. I'm not gonna eat this now, but um, they have a small container of, well, I got a small container of conch soup. So, really excited for that. I told them no dumplings, so hopefully it don't have dumplings in here because I don't like dumplings at all. Um, <clears throat> but, 
yeah i guess when i'm eating it i'll show you guys like how it looks and what's in here but they have no um no nothing ready and that's wild because the lady told me to come here early because there's always a line and from my experience i know there's always a line but nothing like absolutely nothing i feel so betrayed okay guys so we have our kong soup i told him not to put dumpling in it so i hope it really doesn't have dumpling in it because i ain't able it smells good mommy i'm gonna save you some mm -hmm. well then i'm gonna get another one for you no Did but i don't time, or just cash? I want my cash in my mouth, so I don't even know. Oh, you had cash? And I think the guy in front of me had cash too. Yeah, I don't. I don't know so good, but I think, uh... The conch pieces. They look so juicy. It's fine. And then tomorrow, I have to go get my sauce and my goat water. Yeah. You liked it? Mm-hmm. Would you come here again? Yeah, I'm gonna come over. Come over my Oh, you do your fingers? But they ain't gonna see it. They're not gonna see like that, you know. Men that get away with men get away with that. Everybody said that to you, they say, but you are living right there behind you. Yeah. Let me turn this off. Hey guys, so um, I'm meeting some friends for dinner. Um, I wanted to like do this at home, but the lighting home is terrible. And this actually to me like looks better, which is wild because I'm in um, I'm in my car. I'm back at Yacht Haven, um, where my mom and I went to get our pedicures. Was it yesterday? Um, I'm meeting two of my friends. Really excited to see them after so so long. You see, like I'm flashing my ring because my ring is so shiny and pretty, guys. But anyways, yeah, I'm meeting them um, at the same lady Shamika who did um, my pedicure. She and her husband own two restaurants, and we're going to one of them right now. I've heard such amazing things, so I'm excited. I didn't want to tell them like that I know her because I don't like to do stuff like that. Um, because she was like oh tell them um she told me to tell them you know that um she like i'm like a guest or whatever but i'm not gonna do that i feel like that's wild so really excited to try this out the menu when i saw it it looked insane <laughs> oh you look so cute <laughs> are we advertising ourselves to the people on the internet <laughs> She didn't even miss our beat. This is a TikTok. Look how I need to follow you. I need to follow you. She said only as in that's a girl. I get two people following me. <laughs> Look one of them day. <laughs> now it looks so cute. What are we drinking? What's Shani's drinking? Come in. We have a mango passion mojito. Looks good. Looks good. We have a passion fruit mojito. Shani's better one as well. And we have aqua. Oh we have aqua. Display the bottle. Display the bottle. Look at that fancy bottle. Display it. I think that's like electrolytes on your
That's perfect. That's perfect. <laughs>